Run. Oh, and I, I spoke too soon. I'm taking damage. I'm taking damage. I'm taking damage. All right, well, uh, I just loaded into a brand new world, and this is gonna be Minecraft Ultra Hardcore. Now, if anyone has ever seen any of my other videos, you know that, uh, well, I die a lot, and I take a lot of damage. Oh, no, 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 I, oh, which means this challenge for me is actually gonna be pretty hard, so I'm definitely gonna have to take a different approach to doing basically everything, to mining, to going to the nether, to beating the end dragon, to everything. It's gonna be hard. So we can start off the basics like usual, and I'm definitely not gonna wanna uh, spend the night out in the darkness with all the mobs because that's a surefire way for me to dying very, very quickly. So, hey, oh, look at that. We, we, yep, we need sheep. Sheep, come here, I need a bed. You know what? I don't have a sword yet, so a wooden sword is gonna have to do, and all these sheep, yep, you're all gonna die. Oh, do not, do not hit the doggy. No, 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 back away, back away, back away, back away. No, I'm not taking damage yet. I will not. Well, I guess all these dogs are just gonna go hunting for us. Yeah. Kill him, kill him. Yeah, get him, doggy. Oh, yeah. Now, don't hurt me. Do, don't, don't, don't hurt me. Well, I guess things are starting off pretty easy for us. Thanks, little dog. Oh, yeah, little dog. Go get him, get him, get him, get him. Got him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Pause the video. 90% of you guys are not even subscribed. So go ahead, click that big red button, and then you're free to enjoy the video. Okay, continue. So objective number one is complete. That took about all of, I don't know, four seconds here in this ultra hardcore world. So I guess next up is uh, getting some building materials. And then we are, uh, well, I'm going to try uh, to go collect some cobble. And I think I'm going to strip mine because normal mining, we all know what happens when I go normal mining. It it doesn't end up it doesn't end up working well nope oh hello mr desert um nice to see you here you know maybe i should make a desert home oh gosh please please big splash please do not take any damage falling da oh my gosh i just thought i did um hello forest fire for uh f forest fire forest fire there's a forest fire so i'm really liking this hill thing right here and uh i haven't made a cave home uh, like a, a side cave cliff home in so long so i think that's what i'm gonna do i think i'm gonna oh and there's coal look at that 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 just no you you we know we have to go there now don't mind me i'm doing just going to collect all the coal i can before i get shot at night yep that th th that sounds like the perfect recipe So we got a cube cut out, which is good, but uh, how are we looking on time? And not too good. The sun is going down very quickly and we need, still need to make a bed and make somewhat of a house. Okay, yes, torches, torches are necessary. And boom, okay, there we go, got a bed. Let's go, baby. Actually, I shouldn't have put the torches there. I need to make somewhat of a doorway. And ta-da, there's our, there, there's our cave home. There's our cave home. That's it's, pretty good. It's turning nighttime and the, the fire over there is still, still roaring. So uh, yeah, let, let's get inside before we get shot and to take any damage. Oh, good morning on day number two. I'd call uh, day number one a success, you know? Hey, we got a lot done. We found a place to live and we got some food and bed. That, that's all you can ask for, right? So um, today, I think we are going to go strip mining and we need to start uh, getting armored up um, and, and may maybe find food like, like golden apples or potions or something like that. I, I don't really know. Boom, three pickaxes, let's go baby. Now I want this mine to be really close to my house. So I'm just gonna dig literally straight down. I know they, they never tell you to do that in Minecraft, but I, I'm going to do it. I'm gonna dig straight down. So I think the only thing that could actually really uh, ruin this whole thing is falling into a pit of lava or falling into a cave and then getting shot by Mr. Skeleton Man. And as soon as I speak of that, look down there. That is a creeper in a giant ravine. Are, are you kidding me right now? Hello? What? Hello? Is, is, anything, is there anything down here to shoot at me? Please, please do not shoot at me. Well, you know what they say. If you, if you don't risk it, then you don't get the biscuit. And we're just, we're going across. I can't believe we're actually doing this right now, but we're, we're doing it. Oh my gosh. I'm so scared. You stay over there. Do not come over here. Don't even think about coming over here. You are not welcome. Okay. A sigh of relief. We actually managed to get iron already, which is going to be a super big help for getting armor. Um, but I really don't know where to go from 
from here. I really just want to try to stick to strip mining. I don't want to traverse uh, uh, any caves like this because, um, well, uh, I get shot. Don't even think about coming up here, dude. Don't even think about it. Oh, I missed a piece. Are you kidding me? There we go. I did not forget about you. I'm so sorry, little guy. So uh, besides that iron right there, there is no iron that's actually that easily accessible. So I think we're going to stick with our original game plan and uh, we are just going to keep we're, we're going to go strip mining. I, 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 I'm leaving this place. I got all that I needed uh, for now. All right, well, we just hit the mythical. Baba Bowie. Uh, okay, of course, when I start talking, my thing breaks. But we have hit the mythical Y level 13 here in Minecraft. Yep, the, the, the series is over. We're done. We, we, we did it. No, but uh, this is always that mythical, uh, you know, layer where people are like, oh, Y level 13. And you, you dig a, a three up and then you get, you get all the diamonds. So let's see if we get lucky. I am giving myself till the end of this pickaxe. And then we are going back up to the surface with whatever we take. There we go. We, we, we broke right here and uh, this, this is going to be our stopping point. So, hey, look, we got we got pretty far. Let's head back up. Let's make some armor and uh, let, let's make some food while I'm glitching into the wall. Oh, great. It's 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 still nighttime. It's nighttime on day number two. OK, you know, evasive maneuvers. We are running back as fast as we can. Do not get shot by anyone. Do not. OK, I hear skeletons and zombies. Oh, gosh. Do not shoot me, please. Do not shoot me, please. OK, OK, get inside, get inside. <gasps> OK, there we go. Safety. Let's go to bed. <laughs> All right, so there we go. Day number three, and it is looking good. We're already level eight. We have so much iron already, so much coal. Oh, things could not be going better except, oh, and it's good because I haven't taken damage yet. Why these little guys are over there. Now, Mr. Skeleton, why are you hiding under that tree over there? Bruh. Can you just please step out and burn alive so I don't have to worry about you? Thank you. So we're going to end up clearing this whole mountain out and actually making a giant home. But uh, for now, I think I'm just going to, you know, make a makeshift little furnace area and smelt all my little goodies up, baby. Oh, oh, that is an amazing, amazing sight on day number three. I love it. So if I can, while all that is smelting up, I'm going to go try to collect um, a lot of uh, wood. But um, I'm really now scared that all those mobs are still out there in the forest. Run. Oh, and I, I spoke too soon. I'm taking damage. I'm taking damage. I'm taking damage. Oh, my gosh. This is skeleton shooting at me. No, this is skeleton. Okay, run for my life. Run for my life. Run for my life. Just as everything was going so well, I have an arrow sticking out of my neck. Are you kidding me? On second thought, I'm going to sit here and wait and make some iron armor. That way, if I take damage, I will not take his. I just took four hearts of damage. You know what? We're also going to make a shield because at least if I see the skeletons, I can block them with my shield. Now, do I look like I'm ready to go outside? Yeah, look at that. Full iron armor, iron sword, and a shield. Let's go, baby. Skeletons, you are going to be no match for me. No match for me at all. I'm not I'm not scared at all now going going out here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Mr. Skeleton. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Block, 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 and, block and smack. Block and smack. Yeah, come here. Yeah, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yeah, no, no. You are not. Get out of here. Get out of here. Well, let's start chopping down trees like we were supposed to do and, uh, well, not die. I knew I was going to take damage. I just didn't think it would be on day three by a hidden skeleton under a tree. Oh, that makes me so sad. So this is where my noobness comes in um, from Minecraft. Um, I really, I mean, can, can we get apples to spawn and then can we make our own golden apples? Like, can we, can we make our own or do we have to find them? I'm not really sure. And something just died right there. What? Oh, there we go. Mr. Apple. Hello, Mr. Apple. Well, I'll come back out here in a little bit, but it is, uh, it's approaching nighttime and I am not getting stuck down in the nighttime getting shot by skeletons. No, thank you. I am going home. You know what? I'm going to light up this whole area just because if they spawn, you know what? Maybe they won't be able to spawn under these, these trees and, and just shoot me. All right. Well, that was an eventful day. Let's head into day number four. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
and thank you. Okay, so today I think we should uh, maybe, you know, go on that hunt, get some more apples, and then we are going to head down and, uh, well, <laughs> see, with my Minecraft research, uh, yeah, you can make your yourself your own golden apple. See, I didn't know that. Right. I, I don't know why I didn't know that. Sometimes I feel like I'm the biggest noob, but uh, at least if we get gold, then we can actually make our own golden apples and get that those four hearts back that we lost. Apples, where are you? Apples, I need you. All right, yep, I'm calling it quits. I'm not punching a single more leaf. I only got four apples and like most of day four. Are you kidding me? So I'm just gonna head down in the mines and start. Well, I really wanna either get gold, which is uh, to make the golden apples, and I wanna get diamond. So how many iron pickaxes should we make? I'm just gonna say, you know what? We'll come back up after we destroy two full iron pickaxes. Yep. That, that, that sounds good with me. I also really hope that when we come back up, it is not full nighttime and there's not a bunch of skeletons and creepers all around us. Well, here we go. Wish me luck. And we already found redstone, so that that's good. I don't I don't know what we're gonna do with redstone, but it gives me a lot of experience. Where there is redstone, there will be diamond. Oh my gosh, I just said, just said, where there's redstone, there's gonna be diamond. And look at that, we already found diamond. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me right now? Let's go. Oh yeah, baby, four diamond. Oh my gosh, okay, that, that's luck. That's, that's just some pure day four luck. And there's lapis, what is happening? Well, whatever, whatever gods that I, I angered um, on the first night or on that second day when I got shot, I have completely, okay, well, thank you. Thank you for paying me back. Oh, great. Oh, great. Oh, great. Oh, great. We are in a full ravine, actually. Oh, gosh. But, and I see gold. I see gold. I see gold. Please just no, be no mobs. No mobs. No mobs. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to sneakily get this gold real quick. Let's sneakily get the gold and call it good. Okay, oh, my gosh. Oh, there we go, baby. There we go. A little bit later and more diamonds. Oh, yeah. All right. One pickaxe down and uh, we got one more to go. Oh, and we broke into another ravine and there is a lot of lava, but there's also a lot of ores. So I think what I'm going to do is just completely block this off and we're going to make a right turn. We're just, we're, we're going to go in this direction now. Yep. We're, we're going to go in the other, other direction. Oh, hello, more redstone. Nice to see you again. And we have completely broken our second iron pickaxe, which is always really nice. Now, I know I said that I was going to be done after my two iron pickaxes, but uh, hey, I'm feeling lucky. I have one uh, stone pickaxe left. I'm gonna go until that breaks, and then we'll call the mining trip down. I just really wanna get two more gold, okay? I really want two gold. Oh! Look at that, look at that. Okay, you know what? What are the chances that there's diamond right under this gravel? I don't know, but oh my gosh, there we go. See, I told you I was feeling lucky. Oh yeah, let's collect up the diamond. I don't even know how much I have right now. I think I have seven or is that, does that make it 10? Yep, okay, time to head back. Let's head back and let's smelt everything up, collect everything and start working on our base a little bit. Okay, thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh, it's not nighttime. Okay, all we gotta look out for now is some hidden creeper mans and some skeletons below the trees. So if I can tell correctly, I think we mined all of day five. So that was all of day five. Questions. And then this is, uh, this is day six. This is day six. We're halfway through day six already. What the heck? Let's go ahead and smelt that gold up, baby. And then I don't, oh, oh no, no, our iron. Duh. We, we got, we got to smelt up some of our, some of our iron. Now I have 11 diamond and I know that a diamond pickaxe is super important, but I think for right now, I think living is more important than having a diamond pickaxe and a diamond sword. So I'm just gonna go ahead and make a diamond chest plate that way. Hey, I think we're gonna take, we're gonna take, we're gonna take damage again, but uh, you know, this will help mitigate some of the damage that we take. And you know what? We, we have, we have three leftover diamonds. We're just gonna make a diamond pickaxe. Oh yeah, there we go, baby. You know, I shouldn't even worry about it at all. Look at us, we're balling out on day number six. It's almost one week down. We're doing this thing. Now, where the heck are my apples? G give me an apple, give me an apple and g give me all the gold. And we are finally going to make the amazing Golden Apple. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. 
Yes, I am just going to take you and uh, well, okay. See, if I if I if I did my research right, I, I should. Okay, well, it's it's nighttime. I should be able to eat this. Yes, eat this, and will I recover any health? Oh, I do. I'm recovering health. Thank you. Thank you. Wait, it stopped too hard short. What the heck? It stopped too hard short. Wait, that, I, I thought it was supposed to get me all the way back up. Are you kidding me? Okay, here we go. Day number seven. What do we want to do today? I think we really want to get our base going a little bit more than than this. Like, th like, th like, like. To call this a base is to call, that's just a sin. Like that's terrible looking. So I have some smooth stone smelting up there. I'm gonna make some uh, cool stone bricks. Oh yeah, yeah, you better be ready for that. But I think I'm just gonna completely uh, start digging this thing out and getting an outline a little bit. I honestly have no plans for this base. So it's kind of just straight off the top of my head. there we go day number seven this is the start to our cave home I, I think it looks pretty good you know um this is kind of the design i want to go with uh you know just the logs holding up the cave with the stone bricks and uh you know a little outlook to our uh to our hardcore world i don't know i think it looks really good but guys this has been an amazing start to this hardcore world so let me know down below what i should do what i can do to make this world a little bit easier and um if you have any ideas on anything that would be fun so um as always my name is ben also known as big spash and i'll catch you guys in the next video